When hurricane season approaches, the destructive force it can bring can vary by how strong its winds are. The National Weather Service uses the Saffir-Simpson scale, which measures a hurricane's sustained wind speeds. The scale provides estimates of potential property damage using a 1 to 5 rating system, according to the National Weather Service. A Category 1 hurricane has sustained winds between 74 and 95 miles an hour, according to the National Weather Service. Its very dangerous winds will cause some damage to roofs, shingles, vinyl sidings, and gutters on well-built homes. Winds on Category 2 hurricanes have extremely dangerous winds and are between 96 and 110 miles an hour. Near total power loss is expected with outages that could last from several days to weeks, according to the National Weather Service. Storms that are a category three to five are considered major hurricanes. A category three hurricane has continuous winds between 111 and 129 miles an hour, where devastating damage will occur. Category 4 storms can cause catastrophic damage with their 130 to 156 mile an hour winds. They can cause severe damage to well constructed homes, including damaging the roof and exterior walls. Category 5 hurricanes are the most devastating, with sustained winds of at least 157 miles an hour. The National Weather Service says most areas hit by this type of storm will be uninhabitable for weeks or months. If you are under a hurricane warning, heed evacuation warnings and take precautions ahead of the storm. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.